everybody, this is John live from Cayman. Uh, spring break, got the, uh, got, the, got the family down here doing some snorkeling, scuba diving, and a little bit of trading, and of course, uh, taking a little bit of time off and getting rested and relaxed and ready to go. So right now, it's about 2, it's, well, it's exactly 2.37 Central. Um, obviously, the FOMC numbers have come out, and you can see from the way the ticks here, anytime you get sustained buying up here, plus 1,000, plus 1,200, I mean, you just not only do you get the explosion in price, but you get sustainability. As we get into the last uh, 20 minutes here, the question is, oh my gosh, is this going to sell off? I don't think it is. When you see something like this and we're selling off, we only got like minus 200 ticks and we're not down here at minus 800 or minus 1,000, it's just, think of it as profit taking. Um, I, at this point, uh, we could easily just rally into the close, you know, in the last 10 minutes or so. So right now you got a little bit of profit taking. I'd be surprised to see this tank into the close, but of course, the only attitude to have as a trader is to believe with 100% conviction that anything can happen. Okay, so right now, I'm expecting the markets to rally into the close. I'm expecting the ticks to go back into positive here, but I'm also of the belief that anything can happen. Okay, so with today, the big thing to keep in mind at this point is that bears are in trouble. Uh, we have broken through the snow line. This has kind of been the, the, the make or break kind of a point. You can see right now as I'm doing this, we're at 2,090. Uh, we've been as high as close to, you know, close to 2,100. So coming off a little bit here, got about 20 more minutes left. Uh, at this point, I think shorts are screwed. We've got a weekly squeeze setting up, and you just go with the flow. Um, Yellen's comments came out today. They were very, very dovish, very, very supportive, and, you know, that's not a surprise. That's kind of what we've seen uh, coming. In terms of trades, uh, the, boy, this, one, this one's been really good. This is one we texted out. We've got a nice move here. A lot of questions on targets on this. This is what we did in the trading room. And I am looking this, at this from a bigger perspective of a weekly chart. And this is why I've been buying options out in April with the potential uh, that we could actually get a pretty big move off of this weekly squeeze. Right now, the initial target is 191, which is more of a 1272 extension off the, uh, off the daily there. Okay, and then in terms of today, big thing was, hey, if, the, if Janet come out, came out and said, well, you know what, we're not going to raise interest rates anytime soon, so the dollar's coming off, okay, and if the dollar's coming off, that's helping stocks, and guess what, we're seeing things like oil getting a little bit of a bid here, not much, that's actually a pathetic bounce in oil um, com com you know, comparatively, so ultimately I'm looking for pressure there to the downside, but I mean, gold's getting a decent little bounce here too, and of course, um, if the dollar is going down, oh, that is not the euro, then the euro is coming up a little bit. So there's some dynamics that are happening here in the markets that are going to be very, very powerful in the days ahead. And the biggest one to me, the one that's screaming loud and clear the most is TLT, i.e. the bond market. It's saying that deflation is the main problem that's here. Deflation is here to stay, and that's what we got to do, okay? And that's what we got to focus on. So, um, and there's a lot of lot of positions here that we that we're looking at, that we're managing. Um, Jazz is one, and then another one here that I've been looking at and been following is Amba. Um, I love uh, the consolidation that we have here, and I'm looking for more upward prices there. All right. So in the premium video tonight, I'm going to update all the positions that we're in, and we'll take a look at that in more detail. All right, so one thing I'm excited to announce here, and for those of you that don't know, um, Don Kaufman, uh, formerly of TD, has recently joined our firm and is starting to do, well, Don's the guy that I would look at on, on swim lessons and things like that for anything, especially about in terms of volatility. I mean, the guy knows everything there is to know about options, volatility. And we started asking people, it's like, hey, what are the things that you would like to learn about this? And so what what Don's going to be talking about, because he he has been doing some studies, he's looking for the overall volatility of the markets to explode, and what he wants to talk about specifically is how to trade iron condors in a volatile market. Okay, because the last couple of years, if you haven't noticed, the implied volatility has been overall very very low. So what happens when volatility explodes? How do you then manage this? So he's going to do a two-hour class from 8 to 10 East Coast time. This is going to be Thursday, March 19th. So that's this week. Uh, this will be recorded if you can't attend. 
Don's going to be talking about how to thrive in a volatile market so you can protect your portfolio and maximize your profits, how volatility impacts your trading so you know exactly what to do in a more volatile market. And that's the biggest thing that, that he's seen in working in the, the, uh, the industry as long as he has is in a volatile market, people either have their accounts destroyed because they don't know what they're doing or they thrive. And the ones that thrive is because it's, it's the ones that know exactly what to do with this increase in volatility and how to play it. Uh, he's going to show one iron co condor strategy in a volatile market environment for consistent income, learning the specific step-by-step -step rules to tell you exactly what to do. Okay, no guesswork. You're going to walk away from the class knowing how and when to put on and take off the trade. Also, too, whether you trade a small, like say, $2,000 account or a larger six-figure account or larger portfolio margin account, adding this high probability trade to your trading arsenal is a must, especially with the up with the increase in volatility coming right down the pipeline. And plus, Don always has a wealth of information that he'll share. This will be recorded. So if you cannot uh, attend it live, that's fine. This is a two hour, $97 class. The idea with these $97 class is to give you a ton of actionable information and also offer you the opportunity that you could make this money back on a one or two lot fairly simply. Okay. Hope it helps. Looking forward to seeing you guys on the class, simpleroptions.com forward slash I-C-V-O-L. You guys have a good one, and we'll see you at the next update.